Hi there, I'm Paul from Norway, and today I'm going to make Norwegian waffles. So in Norway, waffles is not typically something we eat for breakfast, it's more like a snack. So if you have friends or family coming over to your home, you'll brew some coffee and you make some Norwegian waffles. To make Norwegian waffles, you need one essential piece of equipment, and that is a Norwegian waffle iron. A Norwegian waffle iron makes quite thin waffles, thinner than a Belgian waffle, for instance. Also, the waffles are heart-shaped. I have a Wilfa waffle iron, but to be honest, there's a lot of different brands out there, and a lot of them are quite good. I'm gonna post a link below where you can find some Norwegian waffle irons online. Tools you need for making a Norwegian waffle batter is a bowl, an electric hand mixer, or you can just use a whisk. We start the recipe with getting a pot. We add some smud, and which you melt on your stove top. While the smud is cooling off, whip egg and sugar together. Add whole milk, flour, vanilla sugar, baking powder, baking soda, and cardamom. And whip it until there are no lumps. Gradually add some water until you get a smooth waffelröre. Not too thin, not too thick. Add the melted smur at the end. You want it to be quite thick, but if it's too doughy, you can add more water or milk. And now we're just gonna let it rest for at least 15 minutes. Better looks perfect. I preheated the waffle iron. I put it on almost max because I like the waffles to be really crispy. Smear some butter into the iron. It's waffle time. Close up and let the magic happen. Ooh, looks perfect. Nice and crispy. Make sure to always have one of these ready. You don't want to put it straight on a plate because then it will become soft. So put it here. So as a chef, I'm allowed to have something we call for a bin, the waffle, a waiting waffle. And that's the very first waffle. Oh, nice and crispy. All right, last waffle coming up. So I'll just use the, the spatula and this will be as big or as small. So now the waffles are done. I'm gonna show you three of the most typical toppings that we use in Norway. A very easy one that I used to eat a lot as a kid is to take some butter and you just smear the butter onto the waffle. And then you take some sugar, sprinkle it over. And you wrap up the waffle. And for the love of God, always eat a Norwegian waffle with your hands. The next one is strawberry jam with sour cream. And this glass is the same one that my grandmother used when we used to come to her place for waffles. So you put some strawberry jam on the waffle, generous amount on the top, you put sour cream. And in Norway, this sour cream is not especially sour. It's quite, quite rich, actually. Fold it up and you eat it. The next one is with brown cheese or Norwegian goat cheese, which is an iconic food from Norway. First, you start with some butter on the waffle. You take the brown cheese and you put on a good amount of it. Then there's a fourth thing, which is not very typical to have on a Norwegian waffle but I have a Canadian wife, so we tend to have maple syrup on and it works really, really well. Thanks a lot for watching this episode. I hope I've inspired you to make some waffles or to try them out when you come visit Norway. Like and subscribe to my channel for more Norway with Paul and I'll see you again soon. Hallelujah.